Sup y'all, welcome back to another video by me, Dina. Go GK Pop Stand since 1998. And this is a uh, marathon type video where I spend some time to get to know a specific group that will be debuting soon. I believe they will be debuting soon, like are more like upcoming. And I definitely have to be checking this out in full detail. Hence why I am a couple of weeks late to this. I had made a list on my YouTube community saying that I will be doing a baby monster marathon and a couple of weeks later here I am. And to make a long story short, my life off of filming and K-pop got really busy and chaotic and I needed to tend to that and especially to be at a uh, mental calmness here for me to be able to even pay attention and absorb. And considering I am a very OG YG stan, I've been with YG since the beginning. I knew I don't think they are even credited. I don't from the last time I remember checking uh, the first group was Sweet Tea, and then there was Big Mama, and then there were soloists like Gomi, and then 21, and then Blackpink, and now we're having Baby Monster. So yeah, I was like, I'm gonna have to check them out. Uh, wait, but before I do this, I did want to uh, Google some information. That's what I usually do. I did this kind of marathon type thing whenever I started checking out XG before their debut. So Baby Monster. Okay, here we go. Uh, Baby Monster. I've also was told or saw somewhere that some of y'all can call them Baymon, like as a short, which is kind of cute. I don't know if that's official, but it's cute. Uh, Baby Monster is an upcoming seven member uh, girl group under YG. I don't see a fandom name yet as of now. Okay, so first member, Ruka. Ruka, dancer and rapper, born 2002, the year I graduated high school. Okay, so she's Japanese. Interesting. She was a former member of a Japanese girl group, Shibu 3 Project. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to assume that they definitely have had a lot of uh, experience of training in their pocket. Okay, next member is Parita. Parita. Yeah, because if I read the... I would have said Farida, Farida or something. Oh, is she Thai? Ah, okay, no wonder. I was like, the name is definitely very Southeast Asian. You know, I'm Khmer, so I kind of tend to recognize the enunciations or wording. Born in 2005, okay, they're definitely young on the young side. Vocalist dancer, okay. She'll be the third Thai idol to debut under YG after Blackpink's Lisa and... Okay, and then there's another member I'm assuming is going to be Thai as well because I see that. Next member that I see is Asa. Asa, okay. She's Japanese. Okay, this, this is very interesting so far. She is the rapper and dancer. All right. <laughs> Has a very high-pitched laugh. It's very cute. All right, next member I'm scrolling to is... Ayun, 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 uh, vocalist, rapper, dancer, center. Okay, center has a question mark. I'm looking at this on kprofiles.com in case you are wondering. So she's Korean, okay? The first Korean member that I'm seeing as of now has a positive attitude towards everything. It is just a random quote that I saw and, you know, I'm definitely down for that. Next member, Haram. Haram is the vocalist dancer she's korean as well child model okay yeah okay they from the little glimpses that i'm seeing here they just definitely seem to just have experience in their pocket which is definitely a nice thing to have before you debut next member i see is rora 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 that's gonna be hard for me to say on my tongue rora korean okay she was a member. Oh, she was already in a group called U.SSO Girl. Next member I'm scrolling to is Chiquita. Chiquita. Okay. Oh, yeah. She's definitely a tie. I see her name. Vocalist, dancer, Magne. She's the baby. She's born in 2009. Oh, my gosh. Man, these youngsters are extremely talented. Okay, so she's the third member after Lisa and Parita. Okay, her biggest inspiration is Lisa. I mean, Lisa inspires us all, la Lisa. Okay, her favorite dish is smoked quail eggs. Okay, I mean, that they do go hard. Okay, um, interesting. It, it's almost kind of like mysterious. Like these photos I'm seeing is like a glare of blue and pink and just a spotlight. Uh, I'm gonna check out the first clip 
called YG Next Movement. I literally have not seen anything yet. So this is going to be a total surprise for me. I'm going to be checking out the YG Next Movement. Then I'm going to move on to their, uh, I think, solo performances. There's one dance performance, okay. And then the rest are all like live performances. All right, um, first things first. Here we go with YG Next Movement. Boys Over Dini here for a quick pause before we get things started. I would like to say an extra thanks to my Captain Jack Sparrows over on my Patreon for the extra support. Y'all literally keep my boat, aka my life, stay afloat along with the rest of the crew. Y'all are the savviest. That's got to be the best part I've ever seen. All right, let's get it. <laughs> This dark sound is very YG. Oh yeah, this is like... Who's the clan with the master plan? YG, baby. Uh-huh, YG, YG, baby. baby. Oh my god, I heard this. Who's the clan with the master plan? YG, baby. 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 Nice. Oh, they are, are they pretty back like the old school roots? Oh, 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 타고난 재능이 있는 친구고 가장 큰 강점은 눈빛에서 하고자 하는 의지가 굉장히 많이 보인다는 거. 배우면 다 약간 뭔가 잘 어울리는 느낌이에요. 전체적으로 너무 잘할 것 같아. 지난 4년 동안 월말 평가를 통해서 저를 놀래켰던 것처럼 oh 세상을 놀래켜줄 그런 스타가 됐으면 좋겠다라는 희망상 눈에 보이는 대로 들리는 대로 평가를 해주시기 바라겠습니다. Okay, this uh, little trailer is very convincing. I mean, not only do we have like well-known and experienced YG artists speaking on their behalf, but we have YG himself. I remember reading somewhere, like the few things I've seen, something about how like uh, this next movement is so big that YG himself is like uh, resurfacing and being a big part of Baby Monster. I don't know if that's correct or anything. If y'all want to correct me in the uh, comments below or just give me some information, I would definitely love it. Um, you know, I don't really trust Twitter very much. But um, okay, let's go ahead and move on to the next video in this playlist, which is Baby Monster Number 1, Haram, live performance. Okay, yeah, this is something that I definitely enjoy. It's kind of like whenever I checked out XG, they had their, each had like their dance performance solo and then uh, they had their rap uh, movement and stuff so and the dance so okay here we go with uh, baby monster number one who is Haram baby her dreams don't get set do you enjoy being hard I know you smell the perfume and the makeup on the shirt you don't believe the stories you know that they're all lies despair has your eyes you stick around but i just don't know if i was a woman baby you never worry about what i do i'll be coming on back to you every night doing your right you're the type of man that deserves good Diamonds and full of rings Baby, you're a star Just wanna show you you are You should <laughs> let me You deserve battle, boy You know you deserve better We should be together Yeah, yeah, yeah Wow
that fade out coming soon. Okay. I definitely will say so far, the way that things have been introduced is very like mysterious and kind of leaving me like even more curious than I was before starting this reaction. Um, Haram has a very lovely kind of a uh, soft but husky voice at the same time from what I'm hearing. And I enjoy that. Um, in the beginning, her voice is very soft and, you know, low tone. And then she has like this like kind of nice deep tone in her voice. And then as the piano progressed and like emotionally, her vocals progressed along with it. And she showed more like her range went up, but then she softened back down, then it fade out. It's very effective. Uh, as far as being mysterious and um, like with showing like boom we're opening showing you this talent uh, closing you know just wait so okay yeah very nice solid but husky voice I don't know if that makes sense I hope it does but very solid okay um nice start so far that's our first real live performance because I think the first video was just more like a trailer Let's move on to baby monster number two, who is Ahyun. Is it Ahyun or Ahyun? I'll, I'll figure it out, hopefully. But here we go with her live performance. <laughs> Okay. What the? You feel it, feel it's all super sunny. I try stop, but it just keeps stopping. I dance on the fire, I'm dancing on the face. Why on me? Why, why, why? From the river and the stars to play. Okay. This is ends off like that uh, again I like this whole fade out opening and then closing you know wait you know um okay I wonder how y'all felt the ones who have been uh y'all who have been focusing on these videos as they released you know first we had Haram it's like oh wow her vocals you know it's like very love all of a sudden number two Ahyun you know coming through with this like sass walking through and she changed up like in the beginning i was like okay this like higher no sass and all of a sudden she busts out into this rap and all of a sudden going back into that sass but more power in her vocals then hits that high note all that at 15 at 15 i couldn't even do algebra so legit this is legitimate af uh, okay, you know what? Th this is great. This is wonderful. I'm excited to see what the hell are they gonna freaking debut with. And not just that, I've only gone through two members. I still have five more to go. I told you, I'm not good at math. But, um, okay, let's uh, move on to what's the next clip after this? According to their. Oh, the next one is uh, uh, the dance performance is in between uh, Ayun and Chiquita. All right. We're gonna go right into see how they do with the dance performance aspect. So, here we go. Oh, so it's gonna be Ruka, Haram, Asa, Rora, Ayun. Okay. Me hella raw, raw, got a little red, a little truck for a star Got a friend like Christina, got a million Man, I'm a good guy, turn to a villain Bully in the pack, turn to a rap, be sitting on my jack eye Had the pieces with a car bomb, in the late bombs in the bay You ain't safe, I'm from a nigga like old dog All we do is ball, all 
All we do is bar. Fucking musicality. Now passed out, leaning in the drop. Ice oh, in the adding to honey. Watching us make a stack house. Gingerbread man, run while you can. All you need is lane. Tully on me, got killers on speed down. Infrared blue. Shout out, don't get packed out. Pully hit a pop of us. I don't think one off with that move there. Can you see now? Can you see now? Can you see now? Swag. Can you see now? Wow. Can you see now? Oh. Can you see now? Oh, I like that. Can you see now? When you see it, I'll be at the scene now. Um, if that was just, that wasn't even all of them. If it was just that, and then a uh, little bit over a minute clip. Wow. That that was a lot. That they already showed a lot, even though this is still like a preview. You know what? The more I keep doing this, I'm either doing a Hadouken or like about to catch a Pokemon. So I'm gonna stop doing that. So uh no, but with that little bit that I just saw, they already showed so much that they can kill not only swag but demeanor and musicality. The freaking like I like this whole switch thing. There's a lot in here that I like. It's very hip hop. I'm excited. Like the fact to know that they are the genes, like the baby of YG, but with the genes of what YG started with. Because I am definitely a big fan of first gen YG. Like there was something just very hip hop about it. And I loved it. It was very different for me. And that's what I grew up getting into K pop with. So seeing this hip hop dance performance here, even though it was short, I'm sold. Like, as if I wasn't already sold with the live performance one and two, I'm sold even more with this. Like, it was very effortless in the way they moved, the little bit of uh, sauce that they added on each of their movement. It's not very robotic, like where, I mean, they were clean, definitely very clean. But the little bit of sass and attitude they added in their movement is what is really pulling me. Okay. Wow. Damn, like these girls at 15, I'm telling you, like, what what are they feeding them? Is there like extra Gatorade and Gatorade that they're drinking? I don't know. Either or, I could have used that at 15. Let's go ahead and move on to live performance number three, which is Chiquita. So here we go with Chiquita. Chiquita from Thailand. To be the strongest of us too. Now look at you sitting there. Wow. Oh, no one's picking up the phone. The party's over and you all alone. I used to give up but me. Chiquita definitely shows range for sure, has very lovely vocals. She brings a lot of emotion in her vocals. The lyrics that she was singing, a lot of it was sad. And the sadder the lyrics got, you know, the more that I heard, uh, like emotion I heard coming out of her vocals. And I like how her vocals are able to, again, kind of like what I heard in Haram, um, you know, progress or crescendo 
I'm just going to use a word that I did. I remember from my violin lessons and classes, but her vocal was able to crescendo as the song got sad and the piano even like started getting louder. And um, she brings it back down to a soft, to almost like a whisper level of emotion. So, all right, let's go ahead and move on to our baby monster number four, who is Asa. So here we go with Asa. Asa from Japan. I go eight all on my side, they gon' ride, they gon' ride, pay out this a homicide. Oh my god, oh my Ooh. god. I said I was gon' retire, you got lie, you got lie. I ain't got no stupid job. This my life, this my way. Mm -hmm. All of y'all was she and watching. This is God's playing so much stop me. I've been sitting from Illuminati. Evil streets are reading on my body, me and scene. Pull up in a rap for Robbie. Don't be trying hey. to put you to be I'm around me. 44 shot try my times if on the 45, T 44 more carbon copy. Wish you was somebody, mm -hmm. this for everybody. Mama pop. Sister, brother, cause I'm the auntie This Ooh. is not such, this is how I This is panorama, this is life's a movie I'm a hammer Gandhi, crazy human, no we on and knock it We're planning hammers, burn a body shot They better use your madness when they talk to bomb It's hard to farm me I've been kidding, second, said nothing left though Jonah looking sicker than a strap though Spanish, don't wanna give me best sauce They must have forgot about next up Spinach cribbing and I'm a god Forget the sticky void, purple money in the escrow Ooh. If I just saying I'm not the one to just playing what I think they really mistaken I was the next though You thought wrong when it all gone, all done A smart bring but don't want I smart bring with Sean John. Tell P did it that I'm all one. I'm gonna be down with a two-way. Get it in all this pop gun. Farmers, we do that too bad. My Jamaica chick got sucks on. Every time I hit it, she be like, walk one. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Uh, first of all, she made me stutter the word gosh and she made me bowing to her. She went off. Okay. She is making me think of, oh my gosh, like the last time. I don't know if y'all know of Lexi from way early days of YG, but she's like making me think of Lexi, but also making me think of one of my other favorite rappers ever in K-pop industry, who is Soyeon from G-Idol. There's something very crisp about her enunciations. Like a, a lot of rap, I really am a big fan whenever rapping is very, it's, it's not all mumble jumble. And me saying mumble jumble, that's not saying uh, anything bad about people who do kind of slur or connect their words. That's fine. That's a specific style of rap. I'm not here to say that rap is objective because it's so not. It's subjective. Art is subjective. Um, but back to my point, I really like Asa's clear enunciation of her syllables. And the flow, the flow changes was very creatively interesting. And even with that, her enunciations stuck within those flows. Like it stayed crisp even though the flows were changing up. And her little attitude and confidence, that along with it, that, that's probably why I went, oh gosh, oh gosh, like, okay. Yeah, Baby Monster's already making me uh, just act out. So uh, I think that's promising. From what I know of me and my reactions, the more I act like a fool, the more they are cool. Uh, let's just go ahead and move on to... The next one, uh, yeah, so we have how many left? We have three left. So we're going to move on to baby monster number five, who is Rora. Rora, that's definitely be hard for me to say, but I'll get used to it. 14. <laughs> like, want to see the number? Oh, she looks like a baby. Wow, her vocals are so mature. Why do you always gotta push me? You know how to do it, baby. Every single bottom red only before I lose control. We took it to fun. Said too many bad things. I don't want the last word, last word. Let this be the last word we share. But we really feel don't care. On some rich, I keep you. Goodness gracious. Say something now. Say something now. Ooh, 
the hairs in my arms are standing. That's TMI, but whatever. Okay, so... Rora. Holy crap. I already feel the fusion, the cohesiveness. Cohesion. Is cohesiveness a word? Of the group. Because she, like, the huskiness is making me think back to Haram's performance. But the high nose is making me think of... uh. Ayan? Is that the whole, that or that? I think that name is definitely going to be hard for me to say as well. But it's making me think of the high notes that were projected there, and then the uh, as um Rora's performance kept going, it made me think back to Chiquita's performance where the emotions were coming and it was like projecting. So yeah, the fact that I'm already feeling cohesion within the group, I also feel like that's definitely very important as far as a promising potential for a group. Okay, all right. That was nice, seriously. Even though she has a baby face, like she could literally be my daughter. But her vocals are so already nicely mature and they didn't even debut yet. Okay. Baby and Monster number six is Farita. I keep wanting to say Parita, but Farita. Farita in Thailand. Thought when I grew up I'll be the same as the ones who gave me my last name Oh, we're not given, we are partaking the same old dreams everyone else takes I'm better than that, I'm better than that I'm living my life so I go to heaven and never come mm -hmm. back But look where I'm at, look where I'm at I'm living Strong. a life that I said I wouldn't I wanna go back I used to call my mom every Sunday what? So she knew her love wasn't far away But now I'm all messed up out in LA Cause I care more about what other people say I used to not take chances with God's name wow. But it's been so long since I last wow. prayed Oh, chills. Uh, I continue to uh, share too much information with y'all because the hairs of my arms are standing. Okay, Farita. Again, proving cohesion within this group already. She started with like this very ASMR level. Like her voice was just really nice to listen to. Like it was very healing. And then, you know, the flow was very quick and still the enunciation, even though... Uh, I'm gonna scroll down because I, I want to remember these names. Asa, Asa's enunciation was really crisp in the rapping. We have here Farita, her enunciation and that quick part in her singing was very crisp as well. And then when she gets up, all of a sudden her vocals like project and it goes into, I'm not a singer, so I don't know specific terms, but it's like a very like strong kind of aspect in her vocals. I would try to imitate it, but I don't want y'all to close out of this because your ears hurt, but her vocals, there's something just very strong about it. And then she goes right back down to that ASMR soft level. And also just giving the emotions in her vocals too. Damn y'all, like seriously, the fact that they're already showing, proving that they're killing it. Like they're well supplied in these different aspects that for me makes a group uh, potential, like their potential high and their future promising. Yeah. Okay. We have the last but not least, baby monster number seven, who is Ruka. So here we go with Ruka. From Japan. Twenty. Okay. Yeah. Hey, hey, I, I, I 
just want a bad boy to make me feel good Ooh. Yeah Make me feel good Watch me kiss your boyfriend oh. <laughs> oh, it do not matter, it's just more back He gon' ride it down like he's mm-hmm. stolen Wreck it like a disc and blind to the rest it. Break a little thing, throw it my direction uh, Make it feel like a bad can Let you step it, I ain't been Moving like this is the eighth grade Been the same, no, I ain't mm. changed Change, you hear the change Voila, talk money, talk dollars Snap back, pair of marks, trick of vibes Different the end again, I'm away, I'm Ooh. on a different level Just in the Mickey Money Town, girl, so we're not 10 in first level, okay, we're in side chamber YG, 3G, could get me, could me, G, that I'm not moving on She could only just say, I can't get it, got it She can buy, take, voila All about, take, voila, about, take, voila She makes me want to throw my arms She can buy, take, voila All about, take, voila Yeah <laughs> About, take, voila Yeah Everybody in the streets, they know. Shit! <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna do my stupid bowing for Ruka because she is resurrecting my fangirlism for one time. One TYM, YG group, first gen, who Teddy was in. I don't know if a lot of y'all know. You know, I think a lot of us YG stands know of uh, Teddy being a producer and songwriter and stuff but he was in the group one tym one time and this totally gave me one time swag what oh my gosh i'm overwhelmed but in a i need more kind of way because usually you know when you're overwhelmed you're like stop I, you know please i'm done versus me right now i'm like give me more like i, I need to know more and I can so see why a lot of y'all were like, Dina, please check out Baby Monster. You know, you said you're the YG stand. Please check them out. My impression so far is clearly very impressed. And not just that, I, from what I know and love of YG from first gen until now, they meant it when they said that they are babies, but with the genes of YG because there's so much cohesion in them so far like already even though it's kind of funny that i say that too because all the clips besides the dance clip where there were just like five of them all the clips they were all it was all individual but yet i can still feel the cohesion even though i watched them individually and together putting everything that i felt and saw together definitely going to be a very promising group that i am very looking forward to i am so looking forward to baby monsters official debut and what they're gonna do all right y'all well thank you so much for checking out my uh, little baby monster marathon here on my youtube i may check out the other playlists that will depend but uh if y'all want to see me check out more baby monster clips and film it here on my youtube instead of me selfishly checking it out on my own uh if y'all can take this quick second to scroll below wherever the like button is and uh give me a thumbs up ski because that'll help me a lot with determining on what I want to do here. I hope you have a great day and until the next video coming up, peace.